Hey what's up guys, welcome to my top 5 BPL cheap strikers for FIFA 16. Now in this video we're going to be going through the best cheap strikers, perfect for any starter squads or just for any BPL squads where you want a really cheap yet effective striker who's going to score you an awful lot of goals, get you up the divisions, get you winning the cups very, very quickly. Now, if you do think I've missed anyone out that you've uncovered and you thought was really good, leave that in the comments below. Always interested to hear what you guys think. Hit the like button, always appreciate that, and hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Now, we're going to kick off with Sadio Mane. I thought he his card was absolutely phenomenal, very, very good indeed. Just by looking at the base card stats, you can see how good he is. And while he is more expensive than anyone else in this video, currently going for around 7 to 8k, I think that's still relatively cheap and very much value for money. The goals that he scored me, he's so, so effective. He can play in a numerous load of positions. You can play him at Cam, he's going to do a great job there play him at centre forward, do a very good job there as well. But for me, I would play him at striker all the way. Very, very good there, very, very effective. And that's mainly because of his pace. 91 acceleration, 91 sprint speed. Combine that with his agility and dribbling, and you, you've got such an effective striker that is very, very tricky for defenders to, to keep hold of. And then when you add in his decent finishing and positioning, You've got a real, real player on your hands. Very, very good. His dribbling feels really good. As I mentioned earlier, obviously, with the balance and agility, he's able to ride challenges very well and hit shots when he's uh, you know, not balanced. And they're still going to be very, very effective and probably go in. So Mane, while he's a bit more expensive, definitely go out and buy him if you can. A very, very good player indeed. Now we're going to go on to a slightly different option. You know, he's more of a budget striker. Danny Ings, he's got the pace, similar to Mane, you know, but he's got a bit more physicality and probably better finishing, in truth. 79 finishing, 70 shot power, 79 positioning. Those are very, very respectable stats for a 75-rated non-rare gold player. Now, when you combine that with his very good acceleration of 89, and when you look at his um, his jumping and his heading, which are very nice indeed as well, and you look at his strength, I think you've got a really good all-rounder who's got that bit of pace to tempt a lot of foot players. We all like a bit of pace. He's also got the finishing, decent dribbling and the physicality. Danny Ings for around 1,000, 1,500 coins is an absolute bargain. He's great for if you're playing him in a starter squad or even just someone to fill up the bench. He's a great option to have. Definitely recommend Danny Ings. Now next we have Diouf. Really, really like this player. He was great last year and he is very good again. An absolute must-have for any BPL starter team. He is so, so effective in so many areas. Now while he doesn't have the dribbling abilities of Ings and Mane, what he does have is absolute speed, power, and precision. Obviously, pace, 90 pace is very, very good indeed. You know, he's got 91 acceleration, 89 sprint speed. So he, he gets going fast and he keeps going very quickly. But his finishing, oh my god, it is so, so good. 82 finishing and 80 shot power is incredible. Very, very good player indeed. Really rate to youth a lot. But more than just finishing, he's got 88 heading on a 78 rated rare goal card. I think he's incredible. And especially when you combine it with 91 jumping and 78 strength. Where do you find that on such a cheap gold card? You just don't. Especially when he's got pace and he's got the other finishing in his locker as well. He isn't just a heading machine. He can do so much more as well. So do you... Definitely recommend him an awful lot. Definitely swing a few crosses in for him, as you would probably for this guy, which is Bonnie. Now, while Bonnie doesn't have the pace, he does have decent dribbling. He's got some of the best shooting in the game in the, in the BPL. And he's also got that physicality and that jumping and the heading. You know, 84 heading, very nice indeed. 86 jumping and 94 strength. He's much more of a hold-up player, you know, perfect to, to partner with maybe Diouf or Mane, for example, if you want that sort of B 
big man, little man, you know, quick, quick and strong combo that has proved very effective in a lot of FIFAs. Bonnie is your man for that. And when he does get a chance, he's always in the right position. 85 positioning, very, very good indeed. But then he's got 83 finishing, 89 shot power and 80 long shots. Really, really good player. When he has the chance, he is going to bury it. He's only a few K, about 2 or 3 K. Well worth going out and buying Bonnie. Really rate him very highly indeed. Now, lastly, but no means least, we have Cameron Jerome. Quite similar to Danny Ings and to Bonnie in, in a lot of regards. They sort of merge together in this card for me. He's got the sort of pace, similar sort of shooting and dribbling to Danny Ings. But he has more of the physicality that, uh, that Bonnie has. You know, 83 strength on a 75 rated non-rare is very, very good indeed. Especially when you consider how quick he is and how decent his finishing is. 75 finish, finishing is very, very good. 83 shot power. You know, he's got 74 heading, so he's quite decent in that area. He's a good all-rounder. In the same way to, to Wings... He's a great start, a striker, and definitely good for your bench if you want to fill up your bench a little bit with some options. Really recommend going out and trying Cameron Jerome. So that was my top five sort of strikers for the BPL that are cheap, affordable, straight off the bat strikers that you can get using, get into your teams that were going to help you score a lot of goals and get you up the divisions very, very quickly. Like I said before, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. If you did, show some love, leave a like, hit the subscribe button. It means an awful lot to me, and peace.